was like, he was being really good in Smash 4 towards the end, but then like, as soon as Ultimate came out, he like, immediately, like, started as one of the best players in SoCal. Yeah, I, a lot of people struggled with Mario in the beginning, uh, because he played so differently, but Master Mario is one of those that can still kind of click with him, even, yeah. uh, even after all uh, the tough stuff. Yeah, yeah, he was like, oh, I don't, I don't get to mash up to him anymore, but I still get to get these combos. Yeah, you just, you just start them differently this time. But right now, Canine oh. going on the offensive there. Double back air, gonna go ahead and take out that stock extremely early. Damn, when your jumps is gone and then you just make sure you're dead. He literally didn't have a jump from the first back air, he just made sure he died. Yeah, and always there on the up airs is always a DI mix up. Do you DI outward and face maybe an air dodge mix up on the fair? Or do you DI in and then just face more combos and get it back air? So yeah. usually I think most people opt for DI in, get the stage control back instead. Yeah, yeah. Oh, nice. Woo! Yep. Then you kill it. Wow. You normally get that. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that down tilt is really good. Scoop up. Second back air still not enough to do it. Oh, yeah, but he used the direct air dodge. Yeah. Dang. That's smart. I was like, all right, you got that, that early stock. It doesn't matter. I'm just going to take no damage and just kill you. Yeah. I mean, a lot of it has to do with that angel uh, platform invincibility since you can't run through people anymore. So a lot of people can capitalize it and keep up their advantage position once they start off under fresh stock. So that really determines a lot about if you can survive that, how long you can keep your lead for. Oh, my God. Uh, okay. That's the Mario literally carried him everywhere across the stage, caught him to the top platform, and then just destroyed him off the top of the game. That was actually such a good reset. Yeah, that was crazy. Yo, you guys are fighting. Oh, now Cannon's doing the same thing to him. Yeah. But right. Wolf doesn't get, like, a kill off the top. <laughs> yeah, not too often. You'll see it. Okay. Big punish coming here on the yeah. forward smash. That was really good instincts from Master Mario. Went in exactly when the forward smash came out, so he didn't catch, like, a spot dodge cancel into, like, up smash or something like that. Yeah. Yeah, took a pretty big gamble going for the this time. Oh, Ooh. nice chase, though. He actually delayed his follow-up, waited for the drift air dodge, and then just Okay, that was actually really good. Yeah. Great awareness from Kanai too, knowing that it would pick up because it looked like it went to the side of him very, very far. But the up smash pickup hitbox was enough to be able to pick him back up. Yeah, yeah, that, that up smash hitbox from Wolf is insane. It's one of those scoop hitbox like uh, Rob. Yeah, too bad not all uh, up smashes have that, unfortunately. But anyways, K9 looking like he's going to try to bring this back around. Goes for an up throw. That's the first attitude of fair. Got I, the thought positioning was, I thought it would go for like a down throw with tech chase to get stage control, put him at the corner. Yeah, I, I think I can understand because he has the three platforms on Battlefield. Maybe he thought he could keep charging underneath, get extra damage that way, rather than like a tech chase mix-up. But let's see. Ooh, try to catch jump there. Not Ooh, quite able to find anything. Oh my. Nice. Just the throw. Where he's going to go. Oh, I, I really don't think he wanted to be on that platform, man. He wanted to have to go, but man, he's keeping him at the ledge. I don't know why Master Mario is so scared there. It is Wolf, though. Yeah. He has so many moves to yeah, and Wolf, Wolf left trapping is always very good, so just being, picking the wrong option at the wrong time. If you get too hasty, then you can get blown up very easily, too. Ooh! The forward smash not going to be able to do it. Okay, finally, right, he gets this down throw. Yeah. Not going to die, but he's really just near this. He's going to play safe. Yeah, be. Okay, the jump. double jump. Oh. Air rush back in, and actually he fast it too, so uh, can I wasn't able to get that up till the time. Oh, this is so scary. I hate moments like this. You can tell everyone is just trying to find that one hit they're looking for. Whew. Yeah, there's not much you can talk about. Oh, they clicked, Brad! Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> Alright, got the jump. Yeah, they're playing very carefully. They know that if they make one wrong mistake, then that's pretty much going to cost them the game. Oh, oh. Shot shield. Oh yeah. my god, that's Mario went for the big, the big play. Like, the big gamble there. I'm pretty sure that's very bad it was safe on block anyway, but... Yeah. Can I literally drop shield at the exact frame the up smash hitbox came out? That's, I hate when that happens. Because it's like, you knew they are going to throw something out, but then you just didn't commit to show you. Yeah. Oh, well. That was a really good, really good game one. Yeah. K9's uh, Wolf is very interesting. He doesn't go for the optimal like, down throw tech chases most of the time. Usually, he, like, it looks like he likes the forward throw to elicit a double jump, and then he likes to catch him in the air with the back air. That seems to be what K9 really likes to do uh, when he has a grab position. So. Yeah, I've been seeing a lot of Wolf this weekend. Uh, Zach Ray, Larry, Charlie, they all had uh, a lot of really good really Wolf, and they all play the character really well. I mean, now, just watching how K9 approaches the character, he has his own kind of style which, which that works for him. That's really yeah. actually respecting a lot of the space that K9 presents, even in disadvantaged positions. Looks like he's trying to bait him out into something, and just like that, thought he could be comfortable in position, then he punishes his dash attack, gets a grab. 
Um, for I mean, just from watching, yeah, he, he really likes to look for a double jump back air. So I think a lot of times, he if they're trying to uh, co recover from high, then they'll land on the platform. Or if they're trying to mix up, land on the platform. Like, Wolf's Bear is a perfect position for that. So that's what I'm predicting. Uh, I think he Ooh. may get a lot of his kills that way. Yeah, see, he can position himself on the platform, try and chase on something. Oh. They are mashing smash attack. Yeah, I mean, both of the, these characters Ooh. have really good smash attacks. They're very safe, uh, easy to get on with. Did you see that? So, uh, Master Mario's back air whipped because um, Wolf pancaked when he did the start of his up smash. Oh, yeah, the low profiles. Those <laughs> yeah. are always uh, fun to try and avoid. That's so funny. Oh, big combo now. Oh, he didn't extend it. Yeah. Yeah, that's the one thing I would uh, I noticed from Ken. I, he's really good with Wolf, don't get me wrong. But sometimes he just... Um, he just doesn't get the max damage on his combos that he can possibly get, mm -hmm. you know? I think he just likes to fade back and, like, retreat with his aerials, you know what I mean? Yeah. I think what he likes to do also is that sometimes he may not go for the optimal punish, but then he'll, like, try to fade back, wait for an option, and then get a bigger punish off of that. Yeah, yeah, he's yeah. getting, oh, a, he's getting a lot of the, the smash reads off of reading an air dodge rather than going for an optimal combo instead. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I guess that's another thing that, uh, that makes K9, you know, style of wolf work for him, I guess. Yeah. I mean, Wolf is a very versatile character. You can play him in a ton of different ways. So, no tech chase that time uh -oh. around, but pick up with the up air. Okay. You have to just yeah. DI in. Yeah, he di um, away from the off stage situation. Yeah. It was worth it. Just take the damage, because you'll live, you know. Yeah, and unless it's a very rare case. <laughs> you may die off the top with like a beer or like a down air or something, but it doesn't look like he's in danger. That great wall jump to be able to mix Ooh. up how he recovered back to stage. The sooner you can get back from the ledge against a character like Wolf, the sooner you can go back to getting the, the, your damage and returning to neutral. And that's extremely important against a character like Wolf, whose ledge trapping is amazing. Oh, yeah. Ken is abusing that to the fullest right now. Nice laser. Oh, he got caught. Oh, yeah. Oh, caught his double jump there. Yeah, yeah, the fireball. Yeah. He wanted to get... It wasn't worth uh, getting the laser trade there. All right, big Mario combo, maybe? Oh, got him with the up air at the end. I wasn't yeah. expecting that. Picked him up. Oof. Goes for the dash attack. Gets a decent amount of damage off that, too. Yeah, this is actually really good for Master Mario. Back throw? Oh, no, he wants the platform extension. Oh, he uh, didn't no, get he, it! Yeah, but Enough time? Yeah, but you can't get a hard punish. Yeah. That, was, that was worth it to yes. go for that. Still, the positioning is really good. He gets out of there. Alrighty, now he's oh, back in fireball. position. Oh, that cross-up was so good. The fireball, but the big back there. I think that was another situation where, uh, where Master Mario was trying to hold shield and then like maybe parry but like he literally dropped shield right when the back air came out uh-huh there's the same thing that happened to canine with the up smash in the right last game. Mm -hmm. that happens a lot of people in this game either like weird shield pokes or like people trying to get like that drop shield drop parry and they just don't time it right and just get hit by something yeah, yeah. either pre too preemptively or just a little bit too late yeah, yeah, yeah. usually the the latter all right, we're going to game three. I'm actually surprised that he let him come back to Pokemon Stadium. I think this is one of Mario's best stages, I, personally. I literally think in this stage list, there's very little stages that Mario's not good on. It's yeah. almost like you don't really get to counterpick him, uh, in, my, in my opinion. I, yeah. I really feel like he's strong on all the stages. I can see that, yeah. yeah. It's kind of like a Cloud in <laughs> Smash 4. He was kind of good on every stage. Yeah, it didn't yeah. really matter. Yeah. But, uh, yeah, I, I always see Master Mario just optimize his uh, up B combos on this stage, and because of the lowest ceiling on Stadium, that's why I'm always worried about um, specific combos like that. Oh, yeah, for sure. I, it's scary, too, because of the way his combos work. Even if you're trying to DI away from the platforms, you just end up in that bad position most of the time. Master Mario, a little bit too late under reaction. Didn't get that down smash. I like the idea of uh, just didn't catch him on the drift, unfortunately. Now he's stuck back on the ledge. Oh, he wanted to dash tag his landing, but that back there is really quick. Nice. Yeah. Got the roll. Yeah, that was uh. very nice. Got the auto cancel, still was able to react to whatever um, ledge option came up, and he was able to reset the situation. Nice. Can's really good at getting these grabs. At, like he's, nice. Not going to die. No Nair here. See, I always think K9 is just going to drop his own Nair at Mario. I feel like even though Mario has like a pretty good up B, the trade will kill him mm -hmm. if he hits. Yeah, I feel like maybe he's uh, weird about it, like a, a B hitbox, like clanking, and then he doesn't, he's not ready for the tech or something. But now just reset the the stock count. So I think he wants to try and maintain a lead yeah, against yeah. this kind of character. 
Nothing wrong with just playing safe on stage. Oh, dang, there it was again. That was actually such a good mix up on the back air. He like jumped right over his head and then did the last second of the back air. Yeah. Ma Master Mario's been getting caught on whiff grab a lot and because of a character like Wolf, he could punish really hard with like just a single bear. That would get the kill for him. Yeah, Kanai actually has really good spacing with this character. The more I watch him play, he's just like right outside of range of a lot of things. Mm -hmm. I mean, that's like the, the brawl <laughs> stuff coming in, you know? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Back throw here. Is that enough? Okay, yeah, yeah. more than enough. <laughs> I was actually gonna question it for a little second, but he's yeah, good. He's very high person. Okay, still really good for Kanai. Oh Oof. my gosh, he just walked forward slightly. Would have been enough. Yeah. He even actually did position for it. Uh, he just didn't position enough, I guess. Uh, didn't quite calculate the distance and trajectory on that. You have to be a physicist to get tech chases, you know? Yeah. Oh, look at the movement. He's so scary. Yeah. <laughs> He's just walking. <laughs> Master Mario wants a big combo starter, but no back air grab. He needed that, and there's the answer of Smash. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I know he's frustrated that he missed his combo starter, and that kind of led to him getting killed there, you know? You know, like, when you miss, like, a thing you got, thought was, like, guaranteed, and then you just try to force it immediately, mm -hmm. like, right after? Right. I feel like that's what happens. Yeah, yeah. exactly. Big nice. opportunity here. Ah, K9's doing a good job on survivability, escaping whatever setups that Master Mario's looking for. If it's not a guaranteed option, then K9's good at getting around the mix-ups that uh, Master Mario's trying to present here. Yeah. Nice. Angled up F2. That just looks so smooth. Oh, caught the jump from ledge. Woo! That's Great. so scary. Dude, that Nair is so good. It covers so much range. It lasts so long. The very, very baby hit of Wolf Nair is still caught the roll. Hey, man, if your character has a sex kick in this game, then it's pretty scary. Old, oh, great DI. Found the corner. Gonna survive just a little bit longer. Oh, he got the jump. Oh, no. He still, oh, I thought he jumped from ledge. Oh. Yeah. Oh. Maybe it was just the first jump, not the second one from ledge. Oh, whew, double forward smash. Wolf Inc. that's not quite connecting today. Yep, can I recognize that he was trying to bait him in the corner to get the up smash? Didn't fall for it. Yeah. And I really like how Kanai is not really forcing his advantage here. He knows that Master Mario is the one that's trying to hunt for the kill, so yep. he's keeping himself in a good position. That time, he kind of overextended himself. That's going to cause yeah. him to stock. But he just barely missed time the up two. It, yeah. it was a good idea because he literally was waiting out for the neutral bit up. Yeah, everything up until that point, he basically did not get hit by anything, and Master Mario was just fishing, and he was able to get a whole bunch of damage. Now he's got himself a solid lead here on the last stock situation. Yeah, K9 plays like the perfect way I would love to see someone play when they have a lead at like high percent like this. Right. Like, I think he recognizes how punishing Master Mario can be, so he's not taking any chances. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. But yeah. of course, you know, don't want to give him too many leeway to make this comeback happen because he can never do it. But oh my God, the whiff punishing, bro! So many whiff grabs, man. I mean, gra I don't blame Master Mario because he can get a lot off of it, but then at the same time, it's like, yo, man, grabs suck in this game. Like, Yeah, whiffing your grab is very... Especially when you run up shield grab, that's like such a bad position to be in, to put Dude. yourself in. Look at Master Mario's face. He, he knows. He knows what we're talking about. Yeah. It, it, it's hard because you're Mario and you can get so much reward off a of grab, and you're so far behind, so you think, like, I, I need to get the grab, you know? Yeah. But k is just, like, walking outside of range again, you know, like... That whip punishing is just really good for him, especially when he has a lead like that. Yeah. All right, so but finally he's going to get a grab. Let's see what he gets off of here. Standard combo. Going to try and extend himself off. Not quite. I just like watching Kanye just walk in the neutral. Yeah. <laughs> it's just so good. It's, it's quite surprising how not too many people actually walk in neutral, actually. It's pretty funny because, like, it's, you can do like, you can act much faster out of walk than, uh, you know, just dashing in this game. Mm-hmm. That time, K9 actually didn't quite DI in back to the stage, so that was a good opportunity for Master Mario to try and get some extra damage here. Still got ledge control. Death? Uh, uh, I double jumped out in time. Then go for the fourth throw, of course. Nope, saving his jump. Doesn't care about the flood here. Oh, Oof. yeah, badly spaced Nair. Unfortunately, Mario doesn't have the best of range. So oh, okay. okay. I thought K9 got that forward smash. But he just barely, barely uh, mistimed it. Yeah. To be fair, Mario's forward smash is basically just the faster version of Wolf's. So yeah. I, I think uh, I think K9 threw his out first, but then I'm, Mario's frame data kind of beat him out there. So this is good for Master Mario. Best lead he's had in a minute. And now he gets to play the game. He likes jab lock. Peace. No tech on that back air. Where'd that stock yeah, go? You're dead. 
He just got comboed and then got put in the tech -tech situation. Oh, yeah. this might be a three stack, actually. Yeah, Master Mario this powering is, up here rough. right when he needed it on a game four situation. Ooh, big combo. Don't air dodge. Okay, <laughs> directional air dodge is fine. But oh, okay. He tried to finish off the jabs there. Not quite going to be able to find oh, it. Now, now he went for it. Good tech. Wow. Yeah, great tech. <laughs> that kind of sucks. I think he's still got two stocks to work with, though, and yeah. K9 is basically on the last limbs of his last stock here. So, Oh, oh and my. that is the last limb of his last stock there. So K9 was, like, forcing the fastball fair just to get a combo starter, and then when he jumped to land the fair, he immediately got anti-air up air with no jump, and then just, that's a combo. Like, you can't escape the four there. Yeah, that's, uh, that's a new Falcon combo yeah. in this game, <laughs> falling, falling up air to four there. Well, it worked in Smash 4, too. It just much better in this game because up air is insane. Like the hitbox is insane and like how fast it comes out in comparison to Smash Bros. Yeah, they gave, they gave Mario Falcons up air from the last game. Yeah. Basically. All right, we're here in a game five scenario, game Town five. and City. Right? Exactly what I wanted yeah. between these two. My bias though is uh, for K9 because he has not won uh, in a in a while. <laughs> and it's like the last one for the PR. So it would mean a lot for him to win over Master Mario here. Yeah, I can't wait till until we see what that new PR looks like. There's going to be a lot of new people on it for yeah. sure. Yeah, a lot of SoCal unranked is going to get kicked oh. out of the club. Woo! That Rest. was such a scary position to be in. Yeah. When Mario's under you and you have no jumps at the top platform. Right. You could have just died. Okay, air to air beats him out. Oh, I thought he would chase the landing a little bit more uh, aggressively there since he didn't have a jump. Mm -hmm. oh. All right. I always like Flood as an option for a character like Mario. Just be able to get free stage control if you catch him in the air. Yeah. Oh, nice. Ooh. Knew it. He was spaced for the roll so well. Let's see if he can't get any extra credit here. He's going to need it if he wants to actually submit a lead here because it's so close for him to die. Oh! Oh, oh. no. Master Mario was just barely misspaced. That was a really good tech chase. Yeah, he's trying to find like the double jump or when K9 rises into the air. Oh, he's not quite finding it. There nice. we go. Lance into the back air, catches him on a short hop. No percent taken. Exactly what you would want for Master Mario. Yeah. Nice. Okay, badly spaced in air. Yep. He's gonna need a big punish for that. Yeah, oh. free damage there. All right, they're both. Kana's looking for that combo starter. Yeah, they're both looking for that combo starter. Rising up air or the the falling fair. Oh, one nice. of the two. Oh, nice. Got the jump. Oh, that's death. Oh, Never mind. Oh, what? I think that cape was a B reverse. It had, B. To, be. It had to be. Yeah. There's no other thing it could have been. So that's unfortunate, actually. I could just pretty much jinx that when I said that's death. Oh, got Still another opportunity. Him, Dude, this was such a good stage for Master Mario. I don't know what. Or, I mean, I know you can't really counter pick Mario, but like, I would not want to go on this stage. Yeah, man. This you just, you, you so just got to wait for the Kalos variant to pop up, and then all of a sudden it's Wolf stage. Well, yeah, it's looking a little bit scary here. Yeah. Big lead for Master Mario, in my opinion. But here's a tech chase for K9. Good DI on that down throw. He actually went really high, so he couldn't follow him that well. Oh, yeah, that was a risky back air. Wow, just grabbed scene. him out of nowhere. Wow, shine looks good. Not bad. Yeah. Oh, it, it is, is a projectile, going? technically. Oh my god, you chased him so far. Oh, that was such a risky neutral air for K9. Almost landed to the up smash. Yeah, bad jump. And now he's off stage. Net. Oh, it, yeah, he had no jump there. Yeah, he had no jump. Mm -hmm. I think he might have been able to drift his up B, possibly, but now let's see what Ken can do. Does not want to get grabbed, doesn't want to get up aired. Basically, just don't get touched. That was scenario. very, very, oh. very good for Master Mario. I love how in defensive positions, like when he has to decide a tech chase option or when he has to decide when he's going to double jump, he never does it. He always drifts towards the ledge. He picks the safest option away from Wolf. Yep. He doesn't think about trying to get back to the stage. He looks for his right opportunity instead. Oh, anti-air. Uh, it took 66, though. That's not too bad for Master Mario. Yeah. Opens but up a lot of combos for Master Mario, though. So he can get a lot of damage off of him. Just like Ooh. this. Just like that. Big damage. Now can I that kill percent? Yeah. Let's be real. He was, he was always that kill percent. <laughs> this oh. is a matter of positioning. Well, here we go. Big opportunity for K9 to get something here. But he gets the up air. Can't follow up with anything oh. else, though. Can I try to make something happen here? Let's see if you can make the big comeback happen. Nice. Oh, Woo, I thought K9 was just about to drop zone there, there, and just oh. like end his life. Not quite. Nice trapping here. How does he get back around? Oh, 
That was a very risky jump for K9 to get to center stage. Now he's off stage in a really rough spot. Great shine, though. Where's he going to go here, though? At the ledge, chasing all these safe back airs. Oh, Good trying trip. to go for the up smash. Tech chase away. Oh, oh bad trade for K9. I thought he could get that back air to hit him off the stage. Ooh, Ooh he didn't auto cancel it in time. The timing's oh my. just not there. He hit him before the up smash came out. K9 puts this out. Oh, oh. He doesn't. He just gets another oh grab. God, Resets the situation. Grab. Doesn't go for the edge guard again. Smash? Oh my Ooh, god. He just walked and he no just took the back spot. air. No yeah. spot on the back air. This is such a scary. Oh, he grabbed me for the up smash again. Oh, oh he takes his away, but he gets it up air. He doesn't go. Oh, bad he doesn't connect it. Oh, oh, the trade and the up smash comes out. Master Mario oh, barely gets that traded. game and the set there. Oh, it traded. Oh my god. Woo. That was some. Heart pumping action. Jesus, that was way too intense.